the upper regions of Himalayas. No one knew who he was, where he came from. The origins of this spectacular being were unknown. When his ecstasy allowed him some movement, he danced wildly. When intensity peaked, he became utterly still. People saw that he was experiencing dimensions that no one had ever known or able to fathom. His ecstasy and intensity allowed him to transcend his physical form. Witnessing an individual's unit in union with the cosmos, they called him a yogi, as he was the first one, the Adi Yogi. He expounded 112 methods of attainment, offering his disciples access to the deepest inards of creation.
In this magnificent state of yoga, many mysteries of the created and the uncreated cascaded upon his unbridled wild hair. Cosmos in all its profundity and magnificence, a vision of the unfathomable mysteries of the universe, a most overwhelming vision the sages and Devi Parvati had ever witnessed. Devi Parvati, seeing Adiyo, reveling in ecstatic states, said, I want to have what you have. Show me the way. Sages, the Saptarishis, took the sacred science of yoga in all its forms to human habitations across the planet, which turned into crucibles of civilization.
ever been is not of the past, but the future of humanity. To move humanity from these nations of ups and downs to human existence. Thank <laughs> you. 